The post was shared thousands of times in just hours and had a lot of people uttering the word skinwalker, a well-known legend in Indian country. Oh, I see it. That's incredible. Look at that. Yeah. What do you think that is, man? I don't know. It could potentially be a set of eyes. Something shocking happened at the Skinwalker Ranch, and you'd be surprised to find out what it is. It was beyond human comprehension and ultimately led to evacuation due to the concerns surrounding it. So what's happening at the Skinwalker Ranch, and are we going into something extraterrestrial here? This video will cover all aspects of this strange phenomenon, so stick to the end of this video, because the results might just shock you. The Skinwalker Ranch is known to be the home of some of the craziest, scariest, and most shocking discoveries for a long time now. Whether it's UFOs, glowing eyes of mysterious creatures, or even paranormal activities, these terrifying instances have haunted the ranch and become the main reason for it getting sold. But before we get into these mysteries, we must understand what exactly the Skinwalker Ranch is, its history, and what caused a place so unique to be sold. It's a secluded property in Utah's Uinta County. Rugged mountains surround Utah, which has a unique setting and is at the highest altitude in the United States. It covers 512 acres of land, but its history is quite interesting and could be linked to all the phenomena that's been happening recently. If you ask a regular person from the area, they'll tell you some of the craziest stories, and it's normal because the ranch has its lore filled with hundreds of legends. People surrounding this area believe that the ranch is a place where the natural and supernatural coexist. But why exactly is this ranch called the Skinwalker Ranch? If you're on social media, you might have already heard about what a skinwalker is. It's a creature that's a shapeshifter, and it haunts you down using its sneaky tactics. This mythology has been here for thousands of years. It spans Native America's history, which explains that a skinwalker is a creature that can be described as an evil witch taking the form of any animal or human. Most Utah locals are scared of the skinwalkers, which is why they don't mess too much with the strange phenomenon that goes on all over the place. But what about the history of this particular ranch? The Skinwalker Ranch was named the Sherman Ranch before it was haunted and was highlighted as a strange land. In 1994, Terry and Gwen Sherman were ranchers who bought this ranch and wanted to start a new lifestyle. But they didn't know their life would change after shifting to such a remote area. Soon after moving, they realized that it was a living nightmare. They saw cattle mutilations, glowing orbs of light, which we'll discuss later in this video, and even flying objects. This ranch has been home to strange sightings for decades, and they just won't stop. Interestingly enough, no one seems to ever get to the bottom or even close to what's happened until now. The couple living in the Sherman Ranch also felt evil energy, making their sleep harder and haunting their animals but they endured all of this for some four hard years until they finally decided to leave and start a new life elsewhere. In 1998, the couple sold the ranch to Robert Bigelow for a whopping $200,000, who was a billionaire obsessed and fascinated with the strange phenomena of the ranch and wanted to find out what it was all about. He was so interested in this ranch that he founded the National Institute of Discovery Science, or NIDS, this specialized organization hired experts from various fields to study the ranch and understand the paranormal activity. This ranch was equipped with state-of-the-art technology, like advanced cameras, sensors, radars, and specialized equipment to discover strange things that were happening there. Bigelow wanted to find the answers to the myths in Utah's country for centuries. The NIDS tried for years, but ultimately failed because the ranch was mostly unpredictable. Sure, they had some strange phenomena happening every single time, but no one seems to capture what it exactly is. The more someone tries to investigate this ranch, the bigger questions they're left with. Some people have said that evil spirits haunt it, while others have said that it's an ideal place for extraterrestrials to hide. The research team has collected a ton of data within these experiments, but they could never explain what it is. We have seen a lot of strange events, and at this point, they're even caught on camera, but there's always an explanation to ignore them until now. So far, the Skinwalker Ranch is a place that has inspired countless documentaries, books, and curious individuals, but everyone who's ever tried revealing the secret ultimately failed. So what could be happening at this ranch? A recent experiment showed us that we're onto something. 
something strange and intimidating. Not so long ago, a discovery at the Skinwalker Ranch was so disturbing that it immediately led to its evacuation. The experiment for this ranch brought the high-speed camera expert Burdett Anderson, who was very enthusiastic about this project, wanting to use his knowledge of cameras and state-of-the-art technology to uncover the secrets of this ranch. But after the experimentation, they discovered something even more disturbing. The experiment was done in the enigmatic east field of the Skinwalker Ranch. While this is not as famous as the Mesa, which is the most popular for having skinwalkers and other strange happenings, this place is also as mysterious and odd when it comes to the weird phenomenon, and this experiment confirmed it. The team had already captured a weird happening on the cameras, but they wanted Burdett's help to get to the bottom of this pit because there was something very strange happening at this ranch. This time, the team did a unique experiment to discover the East Field. The experiment was simple. It was as straightforward as getting out the acoustic sounds in the environment and then seeing the effect the sound had on the surroundings of this field. To understand the effects, they even used high-speed cameras to capture any possible reaction due to the sound, which was a smart move, because they discovered something intimidating. This experiment aimed to discover hidden secrets or illicit responses that might happen after they laid down the sound and sent it out into the world. The team was quite excited, yet nervous to see what would happen once they sent out the sound frequencies to the mysterious landscape of the Skinwalker Ranch right above their heads. Moreover, these frequencies were changing, meaning the aim was also to see how the environment would react to changing frequencies if it did. Even the scientists were curious to see what these changes in frequencies would do, because they had no idea what would happen in the ranch. Well, the adventure here takes a more of a risky turn as they decide to shoot the sounds. Things then took another interesting turn when the team decided to launch rockets into the air. Here, Eric was in charge of the sound and tone generator, and he would broadcast various acoustic frequencies into the air. At the same time, the team was actively scanning for the RF radiation using the advanced spectrum analyzer. Meanwhile, Burdett, the expert in high-speed cameras, brought all the equipment they would want in an experiment like this and was thrilled to see what this camera would bring. He brought a camera that can capture 2,000 images per second, so no matter how fast an object moves, they can always capture it and see if something strange is going on. So going into this experiment, everyone was wondering about Burdett's high-speed cameras and whether they captured any strange phenomenon that could change their research trajectory. This is what we are about to find out, and with everything in the right place, the team is ready to start the experiment. The plan involved initiating the sound frequencies and launching the rockets into the air, so there would be both visual and sound effects. Time was the key in this experiment, and being professionals, they didn't waste any time getting started with the experiment. Thomas and Caleb were responsible for setting out the rocket launch, while Burdett confirmed that all the cameras were working properly. To sum it up, the experiment incorporated sound, rocketry, and high-speed cameras. As they set everything up, their excitement was on the next level, and their heart rate started racing. Once Burdett gave the word, Eric then filled the environment with sound frequencies. And just like that, the environment was filled with sound. Just moments later, the perfect planning... The rocket is launched while becoming darker and darker in that area. The experiment was a success because the sound and physical movements were perfect. However, after watching the footage closely, Burdett discovered something so shocking that it surprised the whole experiment team. The discovery was unrelated to the experiment, but it became the key to why the evacuation happened. As he was looking into the footage, he found a strange object captured by the high-speed camera that was set up. He quickly ran to Eric for assistance in determining where the flying object would go. Upon looking at the footage closely, we see a glowing light moving away, leaving the research team in shock. However, what's more interesting was the speed of this object, because even with the high-speed camera, it moved away from the place in just a brief period. The high-speed camera captures the velocity of the rocket in just 1.12 seconds. However, when you look at the object in the footage, it traveled half a mile, levitating above the trees, and the team watched it in shock, trying to make sense of what this object in the air was. They almost lost their minds, and one of the guys said, that bird must have a jetpack, cracking jokes while looking at such a shocking discovery that they had. But in all seriousness, the team saw something so unorthodox that they were indeed shocked. 
They had yet to learn what this object was or what this object aimed to achieve. But it couldn't just be a coincidence that they came across this during their experiment. At that time, they saw something high-speed moving away from the east area of the ranch. It didn't look like a bird because birds wouldn't glow. The team was left with questions. They kept thinking about why this entity appeared right after they launched the rocket into the air with varying sound frequencies. The team decided to call it a UAP because they didn't know what it was. However, another shocking discovery is that whatever this object was, it was the fastest documented object ever recorded on the Skinwalker Ranch. This experiment made them go even further into questioning because now there seems to be a risk of an otherworldly creature or something like aliens, but that's not where it ends. To make sense of the timeline of everything that has happened so far, the team decided to get together and discuss it from the start. They discussed the sequence of the sighting to that of the rocket they launched. The sighting in the Skinwalker Ranch occurred merely six seconds right after the rocket was launched into the air. It lasted a little over a second, and in that brief period, the object sped through an impressive trail, defying normal human understanding and traditional propulsion. But that's where the team had an excellent idea. They calculated the object's speed to see if it could be like a plane or a bird. But upon doing their research, they were shocked to find out that the object sped through space at a whopping 3,600 miles per hour, a mere six seconds after their rocket was launched. Was that a coincidence? Certainly not. But this raised many surprises and questions because it moved faster than any artificial object we know. Whether that's an actual rocket or a plane, they don't go nearly as fast as 3,600 miles per hour. But how can an object like that achieve such speed without creating a sonic boom or shockwave to interfere with our world? Another question arose. How could the object move so quickly without showing a sign of propulsion or exhaust? What is this new technology and this strange phenomenon happening at the Skinwalker Ranch? After discussing the mysterious lighting, they thought a lot about the object's frictionless nature, which supported another incident from the Tic Tac incident of 2004, which showed us a similar object flying through the air without showing sound or any exhaust. The team quickly compared the similar natures, which could be the key to what's happened at Skinwalker Ranch. But that's not even the main problem. The main issue of the researchers was that even if the object appeared, how could it just vanish from thin air in mere seconds with no trace to be found? So many questions were left unanswered, but thanks to the first experiment, the team decided to go in for a second round, where they would do this experiment and see potentially different results. But before that, we must discuss the theories regarding this mysterious light appearing. But we have to take it back a notch right now. You see... Skinwalker Ranch has always been where the line between science and the supernatural seems to become one. This place has always been a hot point to some of the biggest and most interesting yet intimidatingly unexplainable occurrences. From unearthly lights, shadows, and dark creatures surrounding the ranch to this mysterious object appearing now, many people wonder how they can make sense of it all. So far, the ranch has been a home to paranormal activities, specifically the unexplained lights that have captured the attention of many locals from the area. Over the years, numerous witnesses have observed paranormal activities with mysterious lights at the top. The witnesses have described them as bright orbs floating gracefully across the sky, while others have reported sudden flashes making the whole landscape bright. And all this supports the recent experiment that has been done. This light was dancing across the horizon, and looking at the very light stunned the whole world. The light was between blue and purple, making them even more confused. However, unlike other lights, this one was interesting. The experiment showed and confirmed that the light was intelligent, moving against the wind quickly. Moreover, the same experiment showed that the light was smart, even changing its trajectory based on the movements of the researchers. Right now, theories have always been around, from scientific explanations to extraterrestrial origins, Something interesting is going on on the ranch. When we talk about scientific research, some researchers have suggested that these lights could be ball lightning or plasma, which is still a rare atmospheric phenomenon that still needs to be fully understood. Other theories state that this could be paranormal activity for a good reason. Many people have reported eerie creatures in the shadows, watching them as they move around. All this could be an interdimensional gateway and the secrets to reaching some extraterrestrial species, other witnesses have also talked about some species appearing out of nowhere and moving, and then they would disappear without any trace. 
when we put all these theories together, there are talks that the Skinwalker Ranch is a place where the veil between our world and the other world is lifted, meaning that we can interact with entities we have no idea about. It's okay when it comes to the light, but some shadows go along with these lights, adding an even creepier layer of mystery to the play. Some researchers, like the ones we discussed earlier, said that they felt like they were being watched by shadows, which was quite unsettling. But we still have this mystery of whether the light is related to this experiment. So let's uncover the second phase of the same experience done by the researcher who did the first one. After being motivated by the first experiment and the unique findings, the researchers decided to take it up a notch and delve deeper into this mystery. First, they looked at all the possible triggers for the UAP. They wondered what exactly worked. Was it the rocket or the sound that triggered the UAP to go at such a high speed? There was another theory in the researchers' heads that it might have been the sound frequency that could have activated some hidden mechanism in the east field. This time, instead of the rocket, they went for a completely sound-based experiment, hoping to find the truth. This time, the focus would be on different frequencies and how the east field would reach them. The team then got ready for the next phase. Eric took charge of the plan and got ready to transmit a range of tones with varying frequencies. Now the team was quite excited to see what this experiment would bring and whether they would witness something even more interesting in this area. The first tone they used was around 400 hertz. This was a relatively high-pitched sound. This experiment was interesting because they noticed that the sound would linger in the air even after the tone was switched off. This would create a strange echo effect which was quite unsettling. However, the echo effect introduced an even more interesting aspect to their investigation. They started wondering what caused the echo effect. At this point, they were thinking that it could be the acoustics of the field or perhaps even the weather. So they decided to test another field in hopes of finding the truth about this intimidating and unsettling Skinwalker Ranch. So they did something interesting. This time, they halved the frequency to 200 hertz, that's where they would look into the sky and listen with a lot of focus. When the frequency reached 192 hertz, they felt it all in their bodies, leaving them surprised and in awe. The ground beneath them started vibrating, which was an even stranger event. It seemed like the sound was almost making a harmonic effect on the earth. The team then started wondering if this phenomenon had a unique significance or power, which might be the nature of this ranch. But that's when everything changed after they saw something above them. This time, they saw another UAP swiftly moving across the sky, leaving them even more surprised and excited that they could make it happen with just sounds and frequencies. But at this point, it was confirmed that there was a link between the sound and the UAP sighting. Looking at this, they remembered the insights of John Dover, a local historian and an expert of the Native American people. John said the Native Americans used sound frequencies to open portals to other dimensions, and the same people have also claimed to see UAPs. So what is it? Could the research team have opened a portal to another dimension? And what is the UAP? Is that an extraterrestrial entity watching us? So many questions remain unanswered, and the research is being done as we speak. Now we ask you, what do you think about the Skinwalker Ranch and its mysteries? Comment down below. And if you want to stay updated with videos like these, consider subscribing to our channel for the latest mysteries.